Scorpios and welcome back for another energy check for the person that's in love with you. How do they currently feel? What steps and actions are they going to take, if any? So this is kind of like a bird's eye view or a behind the scenes look, you know, looking from a higher perspective or spiritual perspective. So you, you have not talked to this person. So there's a lot of things that your person regrets that they did not say. Because it says unspoken regrets, lost words, disappointment. Somebody is disappointed in themselves because maybe someone did not speak their truth. I feel like what one of the things that someone here, you may have kind of intimidated them or they felt intimidated. Or somebody may be feeling bad because they did not tell you just how amazing they think you are. Because you also have the feminine energy. So for some of you guys, your person here is looking at you like, how could they not? Somebody's disappointed in themselves for not acknowledging your femininity. I feel like somebody's regretting it because they did not take your feelings into consideration when they were dealing with you. Because your next card here is letting go, releasing, walking away, moving on. But that's in the reverse. So your person, the person's in love with you, they're having a hard time letting go. Whoever this person is, See, your person is shattered. They could have left you shattered. It says damaged, broken hearted, destroyed, conflicted. Your person could have been damaged and they had too much stuff going on. See, this is why they miss you. Somebody, somebody, did, somebody is disappointed in themselves because someone had the opportunity to let you know just how amazing you were to them, especially in this feminine energy. But they didn't. And now they're disappointed in themselves. Somebody's disappointed in themselves, Scorpios. Somebody here could be disappointed that they did not see your value or that they put somebody before you or before this connection. Now the person that's in love with you is having a hard time moving on and letting it, letting it go. So whoever this person is, they've been spending a lot of time alone. They're withdrawn. They're single. They're not with anyone else. I feel like somebody here, see, somebody is, is, is spending a lot of time because they're in their feelings. See, they're in their emotions here. This is someone here who is really, look, and it's deep. Look, look at all that. See? Somebody regrets that they didn't see because somebody regrets it because they was too busy listening to their pride and their ego. Look at that. See, that could be a Leo. See? It says arrogant, stubborn love. It was hard loving this person. They made it hard for you to love them, and now they regret it. Shock the see now your person is having this major realization because their life is falling apart, upheaval, shock, the unexpected, trouble. See, see your person, your person pride and their ego got in the way of them loving you, and now they miss this feminine energy because they need it. Mm. Ain't that something, child? Ooh, Scorpio, ain't that something? I'm telling you, they miss that feminine energy now. Because your person's going through a storm here, see? Their whole life is, is falling apart here. And the reason why it's falling apart is because your person didn't want to change and they didn't want to do right by you. They was full of themselves. Now they can't control this, nor can they walk away. Because the very thing that they took for granted, they pushed away, they wish they had it now. So now they see your value now. See, because for some of y'all, y'all froze. Because this person was. See, they wasn't changing. Y'all came in here to, to melt them. See, silence, still, there's no words. See, this person was too cold for y'all. Now they stuck in their memories. See, that is spirit speaking. See, now they're stuck in their memories. It says bittersweet dwelling reminiscence. See, because they can't get over this now because now it's finally hitting someone that you are a whole loss. See, grief, sorrow, pain. See, now they're getting the epiphany. But guess what? It's too late because y'all gone. See, there it is. And now you know what's going to happen, god dang it. They know that they're going to have to put on their running shoes, god dang it. The chase, see? It says preparation, relentless pursuit, victory, see? They're going to have to chase you now, see? <laughs> there it is. I said, uh, that it is. You said arrivederci, boo-boo. That ever that feminine energy, I already know her power. She look, see, 
They're getting it now. They're having an epiphany, realization, understanding, awakening now. See? See there? Because your person going through pain, baby. Because they can't get over Scorpio. See? And that's just what it is. See? So let's see what else for the person that's in love with Scorpio. See, somebody cried. Made them miss out and lose a blessing here. That's for some of you guys, y'all. The person in love with you and you in separation. Oh, yeah, they realizing that their pride and their ego caused them to overlook a beautiful blessing. They're getting this epiphany. And now they know that they're going to have to chase you because you worth it, God dang. Y'all see how the cards came out? See? So if you was chasing them, all you got to do is just relax on your feminine energy. Could be a Libra, could be a Leo, could be a Scorpio, unspoken. Yes, somebody was holding their feelings back. Now somebody regrets not letting you know sooner because now, you, you know what, ain't it something? The reason why somebody is regretting not letting you know all of those things because they see it now. Ain't that something? And now they feel like a fool because how could they have not seen it? If their energy would have been right, but they were so full of their pride, so full of their ego, they tried to convince themselves that you didn't matter. And to come to find out you matter, baby, you matter. But it's probably too late because y'all don't already said farewell. Y'all, 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 ooh, Scorpio, see? See, they catching this, see? That's why their life is falling apart. And it don't mean, because I'm telling you, if your mind is being ran or your feelings, it's going to, everything else is going to be off. Your mind not going to be in the game. And everything that you thought you were so good for, you had it all figured out with this ego pride and all this stubborn love. Can't make You can't make me love you. You, you must not know who I am. This is who Scorpio is, Abu. Because... It may be a man's world with all their pride and their ego, but if you move wrong, then you're going to see what it's like to not have no feminine energy in there. And it ain't going to be nothing. It's not going to be nothing, all right? So now I feel like ain't nothing happening. You ain't back down. This person probably wouldn't melt for you. Now they're thinking about all of that crap that they did, Scorpio. So what else for the person in love with Scorpio? Now what's going on in separation? Because this is separation. What's going on with the person in love with Scorpios in separation? What's this about? Unspoken. Now, see? Now look at them. See there? I'm telling you, somebody, ooh, wow. Somebody regrets not telling you how much they really love you. See? Look at these cards. They all came out together. See? Told you. See? See there, somebody regrets that they did not care, that they did not show you emotions, that they wasn't telling you the truth. See, there it is. They regret that. They regret that. That's unspoken. See, there it is. It came out. You just seen it. See, spirit showing you about this person. See, why? Because that feminine energy deserved better than that, than lies. Not wanting to give up control. Somebody regrets not telling you, Scorpio, that they love you. See? Because for some of y'all, y'all cold as ice. Y'all don't want to talk to them because you don't trust them. Because once you let this person into your life and into your heart, they mishandled you. Because you see, and there they go, that king of swords in the reverse. See? This is what they regret not being honest with you. Because they was full of it. They was full of themselves. See? What's up with this feminine energy for the person in love with Scorpio in separation? What is it about this queen? What is it about this feminine energy here for the person in love with Scorpios in separation? What is this feminine energy about? Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel like it's a missed opportunity. Somebody know that they wasn't planning. Somebody, somebody didn't take it serious. Like I feel like somebody see. Somebody was not planning the future with this feminine energy, but that's what you do with the feminine. You grow with them, right? I feel like somebody also regrets that the cycle is over or you came into their life for some type of change. But I feel like the only thing this person was looking after of was just your beauty. With that feminine energy, they became addicted with their... See, there it is. Because you could tell right there because a real man is not going to take advantage of a gem or something precious. But if a man overlooks a, a gem, something valuable, it's because they got the problem. So this person only was interested in fixing their carnal flesh, feeling, feeding their ego. You know what I'm saying? That, that's all they was wanting to do was feed their ego. But guess what happened though? With that feminine energy... 
karma. There it is. Judgment. See? There it is. See? Now, now they can't get over it. See? See, look. Somebody finna make up their mind. They want this. Ooh, Scorpio, they manifesting you, child. Look at them. Somebody want to clean. It's almost like somebody, for some of y'all, the very person who broke your heart want to be the person that heal your heart, Scorpio. Wow. Because somebody waking up, see? They waking up now. What's up with this letting go in reverse? Because they can't move on. Because they, like like I say, somebody regrets not letting you know that you are beautiful. You are amazing. It's, instead, they just took advantage of your beauty and your amazing and your femininity. They took advantage. See, but this person was supposed to handle you in a loving way. See? They were supposed to handle you in a loving way because you were going to give back to this person. But they didn't want that. They wanted the lust. That's what they wanted. And now that same thing, they are addicted to it because they can't get it no more. Because you said farewell, a a beaver dirt you, okay? <laughs> Let it go in the reverse. For the person in love with Scorpio, in separation, what's really going on here? Let us know, Spirit. See, two of ones, I bet you they know what they want now. I'm telling you, when you walk away from people, you, you got to let them know. Look, I ain't got to put up with you, see? They go to Knight of Pentacles here. Now someone is looking at you like something uh, instead of letting go, because if, if something was so wrong about you, why why is it hard for them to let go? It's because they know now that it was you the whole time. So see, they go to Star Card, the Aquarius. Somebody's been healing. Somebody is slowly coming in with some type of stable, solid offer. But somebody is healing because they need to, see? Because they go to the Nine of Pentacles because I feel like somebody really is insecure. And once again, you probably build them up. You know how you invest in them. And you come with that full, that feminine energy, that love and nurturing energy. You ain't chasing after them. So, so, so somebody here took your kindness for weakness because they're the ones with the problem. And the very thing they tried to stick, have you stuck and uh, bound to, which was a physical connection, they're stuck and bound to now because they're the ones that can't let go, all right? Because y'all said farewell, uh, be, be for dirt, all right? So now you got the solitary. So, so if they was all out here, look, they don't want nobody down. See, I told you. See? See, whatever they was putting before you in the past has mysteriously don't, don't, don't do it no more. See, it says solidarity, withdrawn, uh, lonesome, single. See, this them. See, they don't want all of that no more. The very thing that they was listening to their ego to chase after, they don't want it no more. See, because now I feel like somebody is looking for the right one now. See, <laughs> See, they go to Queen of Pentacles with the lovers in reverse and the Knight of Wands in the reverse. See? They went around the world and they, yeah, yeah, they couldn't replace you, Scorpios, and now they want to crawl right back because they're receiving karma and they will learn their lessons with a Scorpio because it's Scorpio season and they're going to come find you. <laughs> Somebody don't even want them that third party. Now they want somebody with some substance here. God dang it. They say, look, this ain't, this ain't working. I thought this was what I wanted. <laughs> but it ain't working, see? Because now you got the ego, the pride, the Leo energy. I'm telling you, somebody thought that they was everything. They thought that they was God's gift to the world. And Spirit was like, well, if you a king, let me give you your queen. If you an emperor, let me give you your empress. But they... <laughs> They, didn't, they couldn't see the forest for the trees, but they see it now. But for some of y'all, it's too late. I told you. Now look what they're going through. They're catching hell, living without a Scorpio. Now, now look at them reminiscing. There they go. You know what they're thinking about? Didn't I tell you they don't want them three cups no more when I tell you they done with them three cups? See, here it is again. See? What's it is? Solitude. It's a uh, withdrawn, lonesome, and single. From what? From them three of cups. They don't even want them their three of cups because they only worried about a that a one. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is funny how these cars come out sometimes. I'm telling you, it ain't no fun. I'm talking about you can make them come out the street. You making them come out the streets. They say, come and rescue me. Somebody said they need you to rescue them from themselves. But unfortunately, they got to do that work. And I feel like somebody is. Some of y'all could have been dealing. Look, look at them. Look at them. 
page of swords, three of swords, see? Because for some of y'all, this person was full of pride and full of ego, and they didn't want to reach out to you. They was trying to sit behind the scenes watching you and stalking you, but they was too prideful to reach out to you to let you know how they feel. Because somebody did, because somebody know that they, they took advantage of a goddess, god dang it. Somebody here who was in their life to love them, they took advantage. See, I told you, see, told you, see. Here they go, but they was trying to hide it. This, this is what they regret, unspoken. It says regrets, unspoken. It says regrets, some words, and disappointment. Somebody, wait a minute, my glasses on. Lost words, see? Unspoken. This is what they didn't tell you that they should have told you, see? There it is, the Ace of Swords in the reverse. See, look at them. King of Cups, look at that. See there? You think this person know that they should have treated you so much better. Look at this connection, y'all. Y'all see this? This is what it is, see? Now you just got the Queen of Cups come out with the Two of Cups? Come on now, see? But they let their pride get in the way. They let their pride get in the way, and now they ain't getting none of that. And now they're going crazy. Their whole life is topsy-turvy, god dang it. They got the upheaval going on. Why is the upheaval here for the person who's in love with Scorpio? Why is there an upheaval? Shock, the unexpected, trouble. Somebody catching it because they looking at you. They may be saying, look, somebody may realize that it's somebody going to have to fight for this. This could be it. See, somebody said that they don't want, see, see, baby, what you thought, see, there's no competition, but for some of y'all, this person's realizing that they're watching you, maybe you got somebody else here, I'm telling you, this person has been through a lot of things in life, Scorpio, but they've never found anyone that motivates them to want to win back your love. And that's really going on with the person that's in love with you. They really are in love with you, but they had to go through this. They had to lose you. They had to take you for granted. Because in taking you for granted and losing you is causing them to have to reflect and introspect and look at themselves, all right? Because that's what it's about. See, Ten of Swords in the reverse here, see? See, somebody's losing a lot, Scorpios. Ooh, I just seen the Six of Pentacles in the reverse. And there's the magician. See, this person's manifesting you back. For some of y'all, somebody else who chose those other situations, they done lost all that. They don't want them no more, see? Because they pulling back. They don't want that no more. They ain't even turned on by that with the lovers and the knight of wands in reverse. Somebody wants somebody for the long haul. So whoever third party they was dealing with, they don't want that now. Now it's falling apart. See? It's falling apart. And everybody feeling some type of way. Because this person, even though they may physically be around other people, if they were, they mind on you though. See? Trying to figure out how can they get you back. See? See? Yeah, they, yeah, yeah, they stuck on you now. Like, I feel like somebody's finna tell everybody else, look, look, oh, look, you know what this was. I'm good. Somebody regrets not telling you just how amazing you are, Scorpio, because I'm feeling you are amazing. They in love. But I feel like they didn't take this relationship serious because this could have been a boss who had it all going on and they looked at you like they could replace you. You know how that pride and arrogance and ego have you feeling like you on top of the world and you invincible? But remember, like James Brown say, yeah, it may be a man's world. Karmic man, toxic, carnal-minded man. But without a woman, this world ain't nothing. It takes that feminine energy to balance her masculine out. But it takes that masculine energy to balance his woman out. So everybody has to do some inner work here. So I hope you are doing your inner work and I feel like you are because that feminine energy busted out, god dang it. And it's that feminine energy then don't have to make any apologies. So for the person that's in love with you, Scorpios, for some of you guys, you, this person here who you are in separation with, it is definitely a divine, strong, soulmate, twin flame connection. And for some of y'all, that same person is going to come back and win you back because it took all of the hell for them to realize who they really love and who they really love. It's you, Scorpios. All right, Scorpios, happy birthday. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.